Okay, what's up guys? Uh, we're here. Uh, -huh. uh we're here. And... At trapping camp. I'll put it right here. So. Alright guys, so we got Dakota here from the trapping camp. Yeah, we got that stick over us so we can use it for sliding. Yeah. It's a really tight space to work in. You could probably use a stick to use it for flagging. Got a night latch on that one. Yeah, but it's really weird. Mm. At least I think so. There we go. Would you set it the same way back for bobcats as you would coyotes? Uh, yeah. It depends. Some people think not, so I do. Now, of course, I haven't trapped very much, so. Yeah. This is really nice ground. Mm-hmm. Pan a little stiff. Get hung on something. Gotta come back here. I don't know why it's doing that. Mm -mm. There we go. Get the night watch. Yeah, it's a night watch. Oh. I think you hit a root from that tree over there. You don't want to bend those. Those won't go in right if you bend them. Yeah. Does Gary use drugs a lot? Uh, he does on cats because cats are sometimes in hard places to uh, really just drive something in. You like it where trees have, there's a lot of trees and wooded areas, so you mainly just hit roots. Like that? Yeah. I might have to put it over there or something. Yeah, I might be able to find a spot if you want to film for a second. Yeah, a second. That's just...
I'll just cut that root clean, yeah. Yeah. That's like clay. Yeah. I don't know if I want it that far over. Oh no, I was just yeah. banging it in. Now I hit a root. Here, try try hitting it a couple more times. You might be able to run past it. It's going in. It's just that clay. Here, you want to hold it? You want me to hit it? I've almost got it. How much more do you want it down? I take it to right here. Okay. It's hard, isn't it? Yeah, that's, that's like clay right down after a little. Yeah, here. Shoo. I'll just say like five more hits. Whoops. I don't think I hit your girl, bro. Yeah, you just nicked it. It's all right. This should be good. Yeah. <laughs> Here, hold this, hold this. I got it. Here, bye, just... Holy crap! Here, let's see. I got some really bad clay where I used to trap, so... Let me try to walk at it. Watch out for that trap. Perfect. Now, yeah, you see that clay? Yeah. That now just tug on your wire. Cable.
this is the trap that I caught my great grandma's dog in. Like I was telling you that. You know what I like to do after I've got everything covered and everything? What? I like to take a little bit of grass and shred it through the sifter. And it just makes it look like everything else. I don't do that because I like my steps to look like something has been digging there. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's what I usually do on dirt holes because the dirt hole is what they're really looking at. We are in western Oklahoma. They have, they got some, they got a 29 and a half pound bobcat this morning. This group did. We were just uh, trapping right on next to the lake. And there was this one area where a bobcat's been showing up every day. We just tried to trap it, and we caught him. First day, too, because we're only here for three days. I didn't get to set anything yesterday, because we got a nail on the tire. We caught him on a scent post. Yeah. After this, I think we're going to put in another scent post and then a DP because we got I think three or four traps with us. Mm -hmm. One time I had turned around with a trap while I was on my knees my finger hit that pan brand new traps that pan was so light it caught four of my fingers. Yep. I got my finger my two middle fingers caught in a four coil trap. Oh. And that four coil bridger, that, that, maybe. Those other kids were trying to come with us. Yeah. We're out here by ourselves because we're the older ones in the group. And so. those other kids, they've never trapped before, so it takes a little while to put out one trap. It's more of a lesson. It's more of a lesson than them getting the sets out. Which I think is better than him just not very explaining very much and just putting stuff in the dirt. Yeah. Sure. You want to hang up the... Flagging? Yeah. How would we do that? Yeah. I've never done it before. He's the expert. Here, if you want, if you want me to record you, take this. I don't usually like to hang them up very high. Sometimes I'll just take a few, like right there, and just put them around the trap. I want to hang something up like right here. Yeah. I got. I'll just take a few smaller ones and put them around the trap, so they'll see that, and then Shoot. they'll be sniffing around. Well, I usually take one decent one. Put it like right up in here. I would put it like right here. Wherever you want me to put it, show me. Here. Like right up in here somewhere. Because uh, that way it's directly above the trap. I'll fit per that should fit perfect. Perfect. Alright, if you want to grab that. Here, I have some of this apple road if you want it. Uh, Use it. I have Bango Tango. Oh, that stuff works pretty good. It's Bobcat Gland or Curiosity. One of the two. Yeah, Bobcat Gland. I catch the heck out of coyotes on them. Do you have any cat pee? No. I just use Fox. Yeah. I'll see what RC told me and use this high walk of God. They get real deep in that hole so they have to work for it. What is that? A serving fork? Uh, it was given to me uh. by Chip Wild about being outdoors. Uh. 
a trapper from. Jeez, that stinks. A trapper from Maryland, I think. Oh. You want to sit that dog proof next? Yeah. That area, you said that there was a coon bed over there? Mm -hmm. That might work. Yeah, probably will. Alright, I'm either going to use gator oil, because I heard that works real good, or... What's gator oil got in it? Gator. My friend from Wisconsin. Mm. He's probably watching this Loki. He told me that the heck out of bobcats with it and he has it on video so i never thought you would catch bobcats on gator so bobcat all right bango tango or gator oil which one do you think i think of bango tango all right or gator oil if you think you'll catch a bobcat on that i'll try bango tango and at the next set Either me or you can put some. Yeah. See how I do that? Mm-hmm. I might try to surround these closer to the light. Anything you we catch tomorrow, I'll let you climb it. Yeah. I'll just be the cameraman. He's got more land to trap. Yeah. yeah. He's killed some pretty big deer, too. The thing I enjoy more than kill, well, trap an animal myself is just watching younger kids learn how to trap. Yep. Um, anything else you would do? Hmm, that looks perfect. But this is going to work. That these cats that are working through here always work down at the lake, and at the lake you'll just see bird feathers everywhere, and I'll be like, "See, there's this, probably a duck over here." There's a levee, uh, not a levee, a washout, mm -hmm. and the washout comes through here, and the deer are working this trail, and we're actually right here. We saw a print, and we think it's a bobcat, and if a deer's working the trail, a bobcat will too. Uh. We're basically finished with this set, so don't forget to like, subscribe, hit that notification button, and I'll see y'all in the next video. Bye-bye.